for my mama. I'm begging y'all, please stop killing each other. An emotional plea for justice tonight. A grandmother murdered in her own bed. Her killer still on the run. And tonight, Tampa police planning to ramp up their efforts to change the no snitching culture in many Bay Area neighborhoods. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan. And I'm Jamison Euler. Sharon Darns Watkins' death, just the latest in a violent string of unsolved murders here in Tampa. Just take a look at these numbers now. Tampa seeing 12 murders during the first half of 2014. During that same time this year, that number nearly doubling to 21. 21 times we've seen scenes just like this one playing out at Darns Watkins. Delaware Avenue home have played out across the city and a large number of those are unsolved. ABC Action News reporter Jake Peterson is live tonight to explain what TPD is doing to crack down on the bloodshed. Jake. And good evening to you. That recent gun buyback program is one of them. The other is to increase patrols in high crime areas like this one in West Tampa. This is where Sharon Darns Watkins live and this is where she was sleeping on that Saturday afternoon when she was gunned down and now police and her family Nobody is safe. Nobody is safe. My mama was in her house. She didn't deserve this. Nobody deserves it. Sharon Darns Watkins' daughter, Shawana Darns, can no longer sleep at night. Y'all took my soul. That's my mama. She never, never coming back. Investigators say her mom was taking a nap Saturday afternoon when someone shot up her bedroom window, killing her. She was a good person she had nothing to do with a be from this side of that side and that's exactly what detectives believe happened watkins was caught in the crossfire between feuding teen neighborhood groups we absolutely know people out there know who did this captain ronald mcmullen says people aren't giving tips to detectives possibly out of fear when people don't stand up to the criminal element the criminals win but if everyone stands up as one you know, you won't have to worry about retaliation. But as of now, there are 13 unsolved homicides just this year. Darns is pleading, praying for no more. My baby keeps saying, Ma, I want my grandma back. I want my mama back. And I can't get her. This crime has to stop. And cops are using grant money to increase those patrols. There is a $3,000 Crime Stoppers reward for any information leading to an arrest. We're live in Tampa tonight. Jake Peterson, ABC Action News.